today we were in Homa Bay to hand over two projects. The first one was in Homa Bay uh, District Hostel where we were handing over a dialysis machine worth about 2 million shillings to the county, hostel, county referral hostel of, of Homa Bay. We learned that they have about 24 patients that use the dialysis machine. Currently, the ones, they, they have just four machines that are there that some often break down and are not able to serve the patients effectively. My patients are on TV twice a week. So the machine is on the any uh, patients wanna, wanna get treatment haraka. We've been having five machines and today we've received one dialysis machine from Safaricom Foundation and we are very glad about it as this is going to help us in uh, managing our patients better as uh, the numbers are increasing day by day. We have come here to Nyaburi Integrated uh, School where we are handing over uh, solar panels uh, to the school. The solar, solar panels are able to provide them with alternative electricity that will help reduce their electricity bills. The panels can produce up to 5 kVA of power, which is enough power to run the whole institution. This goes out to improve the learning environment and conditions for the kids. This is a great achievement and a transforming activity for the disabled children especially. This is a solar solution um, that is meant to provide clean and affordable energy. The school was running an expensive uh, uh, power solution by powering generators um, in the school because we had a lot of power blackouts. You find that, that uh, those SDGs on health and, uh, and, and, uh, and education uh, come in very handy uh, in what we are doing here. Yeah, so when we came here and we donated the, the wheelchairs and uh, the, the pathways at the cost of 1.6 million, so then we realized that they needed uh, that solar and that's why today we are, we are here to launch what we started. We've seen now Safaricom Foundation has donated wheelchairs uh, that the kids are now able to use because before we've been told stories of how the kids were being carried from uh, you know, uh, the lower part of the school to this part. It was a really a challenge. Since our children are physically challenged, we needed a wheelchair to assist the children. Safaricom Foundation brought us the wheelchair and each and every child had his or her own wheelchair. That one has assisted them in the mobility. Another thing is that uh, the moment we got the wheelchairs, we didn't have the pathways that we would roll the children. The children would not use the, path, the wheelchairs without the pathways. So they also constructed for us the pathways which enabled these children to move with ease from one building to another.